Hello everyone, welcome back to Chavez on FIFA TV. Today's presentation will be real chicken with mango pepper pot and fried plantains. Please remember to like, subscribe and share. Also hit that notification bell for more videos to come. Let's start with the marination. So in here I have thyme, onions, garlic, hot pepper and green onions, scallions. I will add this to my blender. And I will be using water instead of oil. Now pour this over my meat. Yes, I use water instead of oil. Why? The meat already have its own fat and this will just give me a nice and even cook off instead of adding excess oil which I will have to throw off when everything is being cooked. Now I will also add some powdered seasoning to my marination. And everything I cook here is actually to taste. There is no real measurement because every chicken is not the same size unless I'm going to be like weighing it out and you can see those are like real just whole leg quarters. I will also add some pimento powder. Lastly I will add some browning, Jamaican caramel, browning sauce, just a little because it's very strong and I don't want it to be really black. So that's enough right there. Now I will massage or rub my seasoning into my meat very gently make sure it's totally mixed together and everything is incorporated oh, they're enjoying their little spa right here make sure all the browning is like being mixed around I'm going to be setting them aside so the seasoning soak in a little bit. Yeah. It's nice. Wow. I wish you could feel all that um, oozing out from all this seasoning burning my eyes right now. That's, that's good too. It's really. They say onion cleans your eyes when it makes you cry. Now for our mango pepper pot. Mango pepper pot is like a kid's snack or a mango salad to something we would be. Uh, served in a resort or a restaurant but it is very simple comprised of like main ingredient green mangoes you gotta have some hot pepper sauce and salt that's what it simple is so I already have my green mango cut up for you right here. Then I'm going to be adding in my pepper sauce. And these are, like I said, to taste, just like that. Then I'm going to be putting in some salt. I also want to add some fresh lemon juice. Mm. 
Yep. Then I'm just gonna mix everything together. Just toss it in. You don't wanna squish your mangoes. Just wanna toss it in just like that. And for the presentation purpose, I'm gonna add in a little bit of uh, fresh scallions. Now for a general pepper pot, we would never be adding scallions. Because our kids don't eat scallions like that. But it helps the presentation. And it also adds a little more taste to it, of course. Make it flavorful to the bite. There you have it. I'm just gonna set that aside and wait for the rest of my dish. Now let's grill our chicken. Already have my skillet preheated over here. Going on the other chicken into here now. Finish this right here on the stove top, or you want to put it in the oven. Today I choose to finish it in the oven. So I'm going to be adding the rest of my marination into it. Get that marinade into there. All over it like that. Can't let this go to waste. It's okay to rinse it down with a little water. So, I uh, add a little water. Nice. Make sure it gets under there. Yes. Very nice. And I'm just going to finish this in the oven. Make sure some of this gets on top. In the end, we will also have sauce because all this juice and this sauce and the ajou from the chicken together is going to give you a nice sauce. Now I'm going to remove it from the stove top, finish it in the oven. My oven is already preheated, so I'm going to stuck it in there for now. Take it from the oven. Occasionally base it so the skin side stay moist. No need to flip it over, just base it. Where did that oil where did that all that oil come from? There's no oil in it.
told you I didn't need any oil in the marination, right? There was absolutely no oil in my marinade. It was just water. Good. Now I will put it back in the oven for a finish. Yeah. So you need to go a little more. Yeah. Hold up, you like the video yet? You subscribe yet? We'll fry the plant now in a chicken soon already. Engines for frying. Nice and gentle. Do not drop everything there. If you're afraid of it, then you'll get burned. All the way down. Nice and easy. All the way down. That's how she likes it. Just like that. Don't get any burn. Fry evenly on both sides, no rush. You're still being guided by time and temperature. No hurry, and you have to have the right temperature. Nice and golden on both sides, that's what you really want. Beauty right there. Beautiful. Now I'll remove them into my paper towel. Just to dump the eye away a little bit and let the excess oil off. Yes. So here we have now our chicken nice and juicy properly cooked through took about 35 to 40 minutes properly cooked through and there we have it ladies and gentlemen a piece for me and a piece for you Thanks for watching. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share. This is how I feel for.